guys. So this is my final episode of Rich Life. And I love this sim so much. This is season three of his series. And as I mentioned before, my whole sim series is like a big generations legacy type thing. So Rich is my patriarch. He is the first sim. And after this episode, which is their wedding in the beautiful islands of Sulani, we will be starting to transition over to Rich's kids and doing LPs with them. So I think for me not to get bored with The Sims, I need the generations, I need the legacies so that I can get attached. So this is what we're doing. So I'm so excited to share his wedding with you guys today. I hope you enjoy it. I had fun making this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment. Please let me know what you think. Let me know what you wanna see with the generations that are coming after him. And yeah, thank you for watching guys. Let's get into just getting ready and stuff. And I'll just talk periodically to let you know what's going on. I haven't decided if this is gonna be like a machinima yet. I'll probably just be describing the scene because that's kind of like what I like watching. So here we go. The girls are just getting ready. This is Rich's daughter, Keisha, and she's going to finish doing Yaya's hair, getting it into that cute little sleek bun that she'll be wearing with her wedding dress. In the background, we have Chanel and Rain, and these are Rich's other daughters. All of these lovely ladies are bridesmaids, so they're just all gonna be getting ready this morning. It's really early in the morning. That's why it's still kind of dark outside. So we're just gonna see what's going on, watch them get ready. Hopefully Keisha does not mess this up, girl, cause she is not a hairstylist, honey. She is not at all a hairstylist, but, ooh, girl. And then Yaya is like, this is this is not this is not it, but Keisha was excited. She was feeling herself. <laughs> Yaya's like, girl, this, this is not what we discussed at all, but um, you can fix it and Keisha's like, yeah, of course I can fix it. Hold on, let me just finish brushing it back. I'm not done yet. In the background, Rain and Chanel are playing. They're teenagers, you guys. So they're like, oh wait, I'm gonna be the maid of honor. She's like, no, I'm the maid of honor. Rain is like, she doesn't even like you like that. And <laughs> Chanel was not having it. She was done, she walked away. But look at the hair, you guys, this is it. I'm so excited, it turned out so freaking cute, yes. So, Yaya is pregnant, so she has to go to the bathroom, but now Rain is just gonna hook up her makeup because Rain's been like getting her makeup together. We were gonna have people come in to do hair and makeup, but Yaya is really just wanting to be low key. She's an actress. Keisha is an up and coming singer. So they just kind of wanted to be real low key. The wedding was supposed to actually happen in Shan San Maishuno, but because paparazzi caught wind of what was going on, they decided to move it somewhere very exclusive. So this wedding is taking place on a yacht, yes. So, you know, that's what's going on. They're keeping it real, like, just the people closest to them. Keisha's in the background texting her friend Jason. If you're not familiar with my LP that involves Keisha, I'm gonna go ahead and link it somewhere so you can check that out. We are starting a little mini series with Keisha and a teen mom series with Chanel. I wanna do a series with Rain, but I'm gonna wait for her to get a little older and go to college, I think. Next, we're gonna check on the boys. So the guys are at the top of the ship getting ready. That's Jason texting Keisha back. He's like, girl, what are you talking about? Like, she's tripping on the phone. He's, he's responding. Look, okay. Over here in the other suit, we have Yaya's dad. Here is Rich, you guys. Rich cut his hair for the wedding. I couldn't believe it. He really cut his hair. He looks so cute. Oh my gosh. But yeah, so he's over here just, just chopping it up, just talking to his groomsmen and Yaya's dad. They are so excited. I love it. I love it for them. This is so cute. So 
Rich is letting them know how excited he is. Rich has loved Yaya since the day he saw her. He actually met her right after he got divorced from his wife at a bar. She was the bartender. They ended up having a one night stand and they had a son together. Yaya was not that interested in him, but he was so interested in her. And finally, they are tying the knot. Yo, he's like, I knew she was gonna fall for you. They had a bet going on. Um, some people did not think um, Yaya was ever gonna commit to Rich, but here we are. Rich thought he lost the ring. He's looking for the ring, you guys. Like, he was so excited and so nervous. He's like, what pocket? I know I put it in a pocket, what pocket? Then he found it. He was like, y'all, no, don't worry. Don't worry, I got it. <laughs> but they are gonna finish getting ready. So Keisha snuck up to come see her dad. She is such a daddy's girl. When we started the Rich Life LP, it was just Keisha and her dad. It's been them, just them for so long. So of course she came up to see how he was doing, to see how everything was going with him and if he's getting ready, if he's nervous, if he's excited. She just came up to see exactly what was going on. So while Keisha was down talking to Rich, Rain was talking to Yaya. Rain has gotten so close to Rich's girlfriend, since, since they've been dating, she really looks at her like a mom figure. So she just wanted to let her know how excited she was to see them getting married. Rich and Keisha had their hugs. Everyone is just so excited. And I, I'm excited, you guys. I'm excited to see this wedding. So let's go ahead and get to the wedding. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you join the fam. And the wedding is next. <laughs> So everything was going great, everyone had their outfits on, everyone was in place. Everybody was getting their stuff together. The guests were arriving. It was amazing, right? Everything was really going good for their wedding day. It was early. They were starting on time and all of that. Like, look at the groomsmen. Aren't they handsome? Yes. There's JC on. Rich is over here giving them instructions and stuff. The girls were all set up. They were ready to go. Yaya was up here with Armani, just getting herself together and collecting her thoughts before she went down and walked down the aisle, you guys. I was so excited. Try to explain. Before she could make it down the aisle, of course, in true Sims fashion, there was a fire. So everybody had to leave the boat. Like, really? On the wedding day, though, they've been here for weeks and no fire. But everybody was getting back together. The girls were a little antsy because of everybody running out, but they were letting everybody know they could come back in so the wedding could get started. Yeah. I'm tongue tied, twisted around your finger like a piece of string. I'm winded, chasing after your ghost is real exhausting. I'm in love, but I don't think it's what I thought it was supposed to be. Love story, no guts and no glory. How did I get so dizzy thinking of you? I don't usually get like this. It's something about you I miss. Could it be we never had that kiss? Well, I don't usually get like this. Get like, get like this. So that was the longest day ever, but we are married, you guys. So let me introduce Mr. and Mrs. Rich and Anaya Romero. Yes. 
thank you again for watching guys again don't forget to like and subscribe i'd love to have you join the fam and i will see you next time keep waiting keep waiting keep waiting keep waiting keep waiting how did i get so dizzy thinking of you i don't usually get like this i don't get like it's something about you i miss could it be we never had that kiss i just want to kiss you well i don't usually get like this get like Oh